Today we'll make an unusual organizer. It will be a safe with tools for a real artist. Sammy, maybe you can let go of these pencils. I doubt that the robber is in our house at the moment. Did you say robber? Where? Where is he? I'm ready to fight. <sighs> Sammy, I guess you won't relax until we finish our organizer. <sighs> You're right, Sue. I have to distract myself. Uh, let me help you with the craft. Oops. Oh, shiver me shatters all my pencils. Maybe you could hide your treasure first and then start helping. Great idea. Be right back. I'll just find a good place. In the meantime, we'll glue the base part. Guys, be careful with the glue, it's super hot. Now we'll install the first wall here. Press it real good against the base. There you go. And here's the second one. Like this. Guys, give a thumbs up. Let's count how many future artists we have here. <laughs> Phew, darn. I hid them in an awesome place. No one will find them. Great news, Sam. I hope it's not my wardrobe. Oh, how did you know? Oh man, now I have to hide them again. <laughs> Good luck, Sammy, and I'll finish with the box. Uh... The bottom of our case is ready. Now we'll move to the lid. Sue, I made these two parts for it. Oh, thanks, Sammy. Two more to go. While Sam is busy with other parts, I'll install the ones he brought. Oh, this color combination is so lovely, right? These two walls are ready, Sue! Already? You made everything so fast! That's because I'm Mr. Speed! Great job! Sam, have you come up with the design for the upper lid of the organizer? Turn the box upside down and have a look. Oh. Well, let's see. <gasps> wow, Sam, you're so cute here. This is a perfect self-portrait. <laughs> Guys, did you like my design? If yes, then give a thumbs up. The lid and the box are ready. Now we'll connect them. Sam made these parts from straws and cardboard. Now we'll show how to make the fastenings watch closely. Just a bit of glue. Careful, it's very hot. And we'll glue it just like this. This is easy peasy. I'll glue the second thing myself. Great, Sammy. And I'll prepare our next materials. Huh? Now we'll have the necessary number of parts. Ugh, Sue, I guess I got stuck. Help me out. Ugh. Oh, wait. Stand still, Sammy. There you go. <laughs> I thought that I'd have to become a part of the, uh, organizer. You'd make a cute decor, but we need you here. And I'll place this here. I got so nervous. I'll go check how my pencils are doing there. Sammy, you're leaving me again? That's not fair. Well, I'll get more interesting craft work then. So we can carry the case around, we'll glue the handle to it. Sound the alarm! The pencils are missing again! We have to do something urgently! Huh. I guess we'll have to upgrade the safe system so no one gets inside. Right, let's get to it right now! Guys, we'll make a real combination lock for our case. And only Sue and I will know the code. No one will get a single thing out of it. Uh, why do you need a notepad? What you mean? To write down the password, of course. Huh. Don't you think that robbers can steal your notes and find out the password? Then I'll have to memorize it by heart. Oh, I don't have much space left on my hard drive. <laughs> then throw something unnecessary out of your memory. Um, hello? Who are you? <gasps> Did you decide to throw me away from your memory? That's how you slimes deal with best friends. I knew it was a joke. Yeah, sure. Look, I prepared this cure for the next part. Huh, that's not a very convincing apology. You can do better. Ugh. And how about this? Sorry, Susie. I won't do it again. <laughs> I can also make jokes, Sammy. Of course, I'm not mad at you. <laughs> so we can start assembling the mechanism. Sam, do you have everything ready? Yeah, I made something, but it seems kind of wrong. Oh, I'll check it now. 
<laughs> That's all right, Sam. But we'll need this part a little later. Phew, I was so worried about it. Sue, what do you think? Are my markers safe? Sammy, I would collect everything in one place so it's easier to hide it all in the organizer. That's a good idea. I'll go bring the most important stuff here. I guess Sam will be busy for a while. And we'll take care of the closing mechanism over here. Look, guys. There are three identical holes in this part. We need to make the same ones in our organizer. But be careful with the awl. Ask an adult to help. There you go, looks perfect! Shoo, look what I found! Don't buy those robbers for sure! Oh, those robbers are very gluttonous. Means they're not just stealing pencils, but eating them! Oh, such a disaster! My poor pencils! Sammy, the answer is somewhere near, but I still don't know how to get to it. And I don't have any ideas, just lots of worries. Don't be sad, Sammy. I'll defo buy you tons of new pencils. But for now, you can help me with the organizer. Bring me the parts for the code input mechanism. You're right. The faster we finish, the sooner I'll hide my stationery. <laughs> and now we'll connect the parts of our mechanism together. Just a drop of glue. And we're connecting it like this. So, hurry up, or those thieves will chew all my pencils! I am trying to do it as quick as possible! It's not enough! Shoo, what is this? I can't understand! I'll tell you now. Go ahead. When the safe lock turns, the hooks get into the holes. Which? Which holes? Uh, these on the caps? I guess I'm starting to understand. Now we'll close the mechanism so no one finds out its secret. Let's try to close it using the password! Well, let's do it! I can't wait to check it out. Just like this. Hop! It's super safe! And now let's put everything back. First nine. Then three. Oops! I have to keep it down. Oh, I sound everything works! The test was successful! The combination lock is ready, but inside, our box still doesn't look like a real organizer. We have to divide everything into sections, too! Otherwise, how am I gonna get you? <sighs> Sammy, are you okay? Oh, this is some weird dream. Everything's flying around. It was a plastic sheet to make the paper holder. Now we'll need this. Right. I'll need to carry them around. You never know where the inspiration comes. It will be a section in the organizer's lid. We'll assemble its lower part now. So, if the thieves ate my pencil, then they can also eat the organizer. You're such an alarmist, Sammy. Our walls are made of five-layered cardboard. Really? Extra caution never hurts. Especially considering that we have robbers around here. It's impossible to argue with you, Sammy. Better help me with the craft. I'm ready. What kind of help do you need right now? We need to glue the parts you're holding to the back side of the section. I'll glue everything real quick now. Watch closely, Susie. So, what do you say? Great job! <laughs> we'll set aside this part for a while. And keep working with our organizer. keep appearing inside on their own. But behind it, there's lots of work to be done. Who do you think cut out all these parts? Huh. If it's not me, the main cardboard specialist, then is it you, Sue? What's up with that surprise voice, Sammy? Do you doubt my talents? Oh, no, Sue, of course not! I've never doubted you! Never. Ever. But I sometimes doubt you, Sue. What? Just kidding! It's so big, Sue! It will take the whole table! Where should I draw, then? I came up with a special holder. 
which will fix the lid in a vertical position. And so what? <laughs> this way you'll see all the pencils. And it will save some space. Smooth move, Sue. Good macaroons, there's so much room here. Let's add some bright, juicy design here. Done. It came out so cool, Sue. Now let's arrange everything. That's my favorite part. We'll start with the markers. Sam really likes to use them in his drawings. This goes here. This is my favorite glitter when I feel more creative. We'll need different types of brushes for various styles of painting. So wait, you forgot my most favorite brush. Oh, sorry, Sammy. I'll try to be more attentive. What else do we need? We can't do without my favorite paints. I can't wait to start creating. You can draw something amazing with graphite pencils, too. And we'll need a sharpener and an eraser for them. Hmm, let's add some more to have some variety. And finally, my treasure! The biggest collection of colored pencils ever! Woohoo! Here we'll place the paper for future masterpieces of our Sam. Let's add some more bright colors. Yay! Wow! That's really something! Let's have another look at our organizer. Hi guys, today we'll help Sammy be able to take everything he needs to paint a picture while traveling. Hi, Ford. Sue, are we going to make another organizer? We are, Sammy, but it's going to be pretty unusual. Your travel keys for stationery will be as light as can be, and it will have a shape like this. By the way, guys, on our channel you can find a lot of videos about how we make different organizers. Whoa, that's a lot of fun! Uh-huh. We need to make our treble keys neat and bright, right? We'll use some glue. <laughs> make way, Susie! Guys, you should always be very careful with the glue gun. Thanks, Sammy. I'll take it from here. Bring me some paint, please. I'll bring all of my favorite colors! <laughs> now we'll carefully place this cardboard template right here and press a little bit. Great! Then we'll use more glue on this side. Don't be stingy with the glue. We want our construction to be sturdy. Guys, now we'll attach one more piece of foam. It should look a bit like a sandwich. <laughs> Done. As you have already guessed, we'll need two of these pieces. <laughs> Did you miss me? <gasps> Sammy, you keep scaring me today. I brought you the most beautiful pink colors that I could find. But don't use all of them, Sue. Or I won't have any of them to take on my trip. <laughs> <laughs> I won't, Sammy, I promise. Guys, this will be the front part of our travel case. Let's make it look outstanding. And that's it! Awesome! Now let's deal with the zipper. Since we're making a travel key, it should be able to close well. Oh, Sue! I can't wait for my journey to begin! It's been a while since I went somewhere that far. I hope they're waiting for me there! If I were you, Sammy, I'd start making a list of what I should take with me right away. I like being prepared for everything in advance. Don't you guys? 
Then give us a thumbs up. Oh, you're right, Sue. I've got to start packing. <gasps> Stop! Uh, where's my Nutella? Ah, uh, Sammy, Sammy. <laughs> okay, guys. This is what I've done with the zipper. It is sort of surrounded by foam now. Our next step will be attaching it to the front part of our future case. Like this. Now comes the back part. As always, guys, be careful with the hot glue. Apply it straight to the edge of this piece and attach it right here. Wow, Sue! My pencil case is turning out so cool! Sue, you know how much I like lots of compartments, right? <laughs> oh, please. Go wash your face, little sweet tooth, before you get the crap dirty. Of course I know everything about Sammy. That's why I have this little outside pocket, guys. It's pretty much made the same way as the main case was made, but it only has one cardboard foam side. Let's glue it. We'll attach it to our case right here. Okay, I'm clean. Are you happy now? Wow! I like this backpack suit, but don't you think that it's kind of too big for my back? <laughs> You're still getting my idea a bit wrong, Sammy. Could you bring me a pencil? What do you mean I'm getting something? <gasps> What's that? We'll use hard cardboard this time. We need to make a hole in the middle of each wheel for the chassis. But be very careful with any sharp objects, guys. Mm. You can always ask an adult to help. Now we gotta make the same openings in the foam circles. There's the pencil, Susie. I also brought the sharpener just in case. We don't need it this time. Today, we'll use the pencil as the chassis. You see? But first, we need to finish with the wheels. Let's glue the colorful pieces of foam onto these cardboard circles from both sides. Done! Sue, did I do everything right? Wow, Sammy, you're a mind reader! All that's left to do is to attach the wheels to this piece from both sides. And the chassis is ready! Susie, let me do something else for you. I feel guilty that you're helping me. And I can't even take you with me as a plus one to that side. Don't be Sammy. You know that I'm always glad to get myself busy with another craft. Of course! I know what I should do! What? Sammy? Guys, I guess we'll be right back. <sighs> Susie, there. These are the stands. Oh, take a breath, Sammy. Thank you. Guys, check out what Sam made. These stands are thick enough. Let's put them in their place. They were made the same way as the wheels. I just used a couple of extra layers of foam. <laughs> and you did great. Basically, all that's left to do is to make a handle for our case. I've got it covered. Welcome, one perfect handle from foam. Sammy, that's not what I was talking about. Although this will come in handy. I meant that in order to be portable, our case really needs a folding handle. We'll make it from two bamboo sticks and two popsicle sticks. Line run, all done! <laughs> Was that a new magic spell? I'm an expert in that. Allow me, Susan. Checking in and checking out. I'll crush the best, no doubt! Sammy, your magic is something. Am I right, guys? Then give us a thumbs up and we'll continue. Sammy, how's your packing process going, by the way? Are you planning to take a lot of stuff with you? Glasses are all I need there. And that pencil case, of course. <laughs> oh, Sammy, you're the readiest slime I know. <laughs> Guys, we've made this thingy from foam. And now we need to glue it right here. It'll block the handle from falling out. We'll do it this way. <laughs> it all works! Terrific! Okay, our travel case is pretty much ready. Want to see how it looks from the inside? Wow! I like it too! There's a lot of space in here! Everything should fit inside! I think it's time to go get my stationery! I have a long list of things! Oh really? How long is it? Hmm... Well then we'd better make a few adjustments right now! And... Hop. Perfect! Let's attach a piece of foam, bent like this, right here. Great! Now we have even more space in here! Uh, here's everything that I plan to take, Susie! Please don't tell me that I have to leave something behind! Uh. 
Oh, I won't, Sammy. Check this out. Whoa! What will we place in between those little thingies? Hmm, let's try this. Perfect. Now we can glue a white strip of foam on the top of these little dividing thingies. There you go. Guys, we need to make a few cuts right now. Be very careful with scissors. You should try to cut the foam right in the middle of each little space. We like working with foam while making different crafts. You can check out the videos about that on our channel. Oh, that's right. <laughs> and the final cut. Done. Just look how easy it is to put a pencil in this place. And take it out when you need it. Let me fill this compartment. <laughs> it took me a second. Looks awesome. Great job, Sam. But let's take one more tiny step to decorate it. Why don't we speed up a bit? Just check out how much stuff we fit in here! Wow! So awesome, Sue! All my markers are in here! And we actually even have some space left! Not for long. Some post-its might come in handy. They're so colorful and bright! That's my favorite part! We can also place something right here. I thought maybe card holders. Done! <laughs> A few final touches. Do you like it, guys? Then give us a thumbs up! By the way, Sue, wanna know what I like the most when we're making different organizers? That you have fewer chances to lose your stationery? No! That you can get creative and decorate your organizer in any way possible! Am I right, guys? Oh, I'm so funny and smart! Oh, you're totally right, Sammy. Getting creative is always the best. And one more thing. Done! I almost forgot to show you what's inside this little compartment. I even made a small magnet place here, so now you have a spot to keep your paper clips. You outdid yourself this time, Sue! Let's check out this travel case for stationery one more!